Adding schedules to a drawing sheet. Here I have a drawing sheet that I inserted in and when I come down to my uh, to my sheets you'll see here it's A102 and I have A102 and now I'm going to add in a schedule. So what I want to do is I can go over to my project browser and I can drag and drop in my schedule. So here I have a door schedule. I can just hold on my left mouse button and drag it over and I can let it go and you'll see that it's at the end of my cursor and I'm going to place in my door schedule at this point and now I'm going to hit escape and now I'm going to zoom in so we can see it a little better and you can see now I have my door schedule on my sheet when I click on my door schedule I get these blue um, triangles. These triangles across the top adjust the uh, the width of the column. Also down on the side I have what's called a split control. You can see it right here on the right side and that allows me to split my uh, schedule into two parts. So I can grab a hold of these with my left mouse button and I can move my columns to be longer or shorter and I can, you know, might need a really long description perhaps. And then I can also uh, come over here and I'm going to hit the split control. When I click on it, it splits my drawing or my schedule into two parts. You can see I have a move control here and I can move it over, for example. I can also grab a hold of this blue grip and I can make my uh, schedule bigger or smaller so more of it shows up on my left or on my right. Okay, so I'll get them to be about the same size. So I can control how my schedules look and if I want to put in another one I can just come over here to my room schedule, drag it over and let it drop and you can see it's at the end of my cursor. I can line it up, click, and place it in. And I can adjust my uh, columns if needed. I also have my split control. Now let's say I'm over here and I want to uh, bring this back and make it into one. Uh, so I'm going to grab a hold of this uh, one. Eh. Grab a hold of this one and I'm going to move it out of the way with my four arrows. Okay. So I'm going to grab a hold of it by the four arrows here. I grab a hold of it by the four arrows. I'm dragging the one part back on top of the other. If I want to rejoin them, I just drag them right on top of each other and I let go and it automatically joins it back into one schedule again.